Hey guys. Is this a makeup video? It's weird. <laughs> um, so, I recently became the proud mama of Spell Cosmetics' Loaded Collection. <laughs> and I decided that I wanted to do a series of videos, like a rainbow series. And Vixen NY and Kitsmitch, Kit, Kitschmiss, uh, they ha they did collaboration videos a while ago, and they did rainbow. But um, theirs are very cool, like party kind of looks. And I am very inappropriate with my makeup. I I wear whatever I want wherever I want, and I have like I give no consideration to whether it's daytime or nighttime. I just wear it if I feel like it. I'm a very like I feel things, you know. So, people come up to me a lot and they're like, wow, I wish I could wear that color. And, I, like, I'm always thinking, like, why can't you wear that color, you know? But I do realize that some people are a little bit more down to earth than, than your space cadet Kimmy over here. And so what I, what I want this uh, video series to be is kind of, you know, people don't think that reds are very wearable. Or, you know, people think that, like, blues or greens are too bright for work. So, I think I'm going to take one color, you know, like, I'll take a color that is a little bit, you know, people might be afraid of. And I'm going to use it to do a look that you could wear to school, that you could wear to the office, and not feel like, hi, I'm wearing red eyeshadow. <laughs> okay? So, I'm just going to go in order of the colors. Oh, and I'll leave links to um, Vixen and Y and Kitschmiss, Kitsmith, Kits, Mitch, um, on the side or this side, whatever the case may be. Uh, so you guys can go and check out their rainbow series of you know bright, cool looks. So today I'm gonna, I'm just gonna start. I'm gonna go in rainbow order, and so that means our first color is red, and this eye is done. So I, I do realize I have kind of a skewed outlook on what might be appropriate, but I'm, I'm. I am 90% confident that most people would wear this look and not feel uncomfortable if you're someone who isn't that comfortable wearing colors. Um, my So our first color is going to be red. looks like that. It's called Lust. Um, it's my favorite shadow in the Loaded collection. See that? Let me shake out a little bit more. Yes. See that? Oh, I just spilled it. <laughs> Let's get started before I... Oh my gosh, I'm out of control. Alright, so... So we're going to start off with this red color. It's called Lust. It's my favorite color out of the Loaded collection. And I'm going to take a fluffy brush. Like that. And I'm putting it in my... Now I've already got, I have Bare Steady paint put on, so it's a shimmery, a light shimmery, champagne-y gold color, uh, but use any kind of base that you want. So there's Lust on a fluffy brush. This is going in my crease. And you don't have to take it all the way in here. If you if you feel more comfortable leaving it right here, go ahead and do that. Whatever you're comfortable with. My camera's distorting the color a little bit. It's coming up a little bit like of an orangey coral color. But it's... Um, it's, I'd call it red with a little bit of copper in it. Okay, so as soon as you have that where you want it, okay, so now I'm going to move on to my next color, which is going to be, this Lust has a slight shimmer to it. So, my next color is going to be a matte. I 
I'm using Swiss chocolate, which is a uh, matte brown. With uh, it's got red in it. It's like a ready brown. And I'm gonna take a little brush like this. So, um, if you want to just use the same brush you used for the red, you could do that. I'm gonna use it because this one's a little bit smaller, and so it's gonna keep the color more concentrated in my crease. So that's going right in my crease. I'm also going to push it kind of towards the middle. Alright, next I'm going to take, I'm taking shroom, you can take any uh, shimmery champagne -y color or if you wanted to do a matte or a satin you could do that, My, there we go. And this is a concealer brush but I'm just going to use it for my eyeshadow because it's little and I want this color to go right in here. And I'm, I'm going in the inner corner, but then I'm also going over any of that brown color that kind of spilled onto my lid while I was doing the crease. Okay. I'm going to take a fluffy brush like this. And I'm just going to brush over it so that it's not so um, blocky, I guess. There we go. I'm going to take a little bit more Swiss chocolate and just go right on the outside here. Alright, now I'm going to take a 217, take any fluffy brush, and I'm going to use brulee. Looks like that. This is a satin, so it's not shimmery, but it's not matte either. And I'm going to use this as my highlight color. I'm going to take it in here too. Now I'm going to take my fluffy brush, I'm not going to, it still has a little bit of color on it, so I'm just going to go over the crease again, like that. Okay, now since this is a daytime look, I'm not going to use a liner, I'm going to use Swiss chocolate again, and a little brush like this, it's a Sonia Kashuk brush. And I'm just going to line my eyes with this. So it's kind of soft and, you know, not harsh. I'm also going to take that on the top. And now all we need is mascara. I'm using, I got the Sephora Lash Dash, and this is Smashbox's Bionic Mascara.
and that's it you're done now if you were going maybe if you're going out after work or after school and you wanted to punch it up a little bit I would probably just do a little bit of black eyeliner in the waterline and maybe a little bit black a little bit of black eyeliner on the top smoke it out if you wanted to um, add a little bit more red for nighttime I think that would be really pretty so this is um, my wearable red look using lust by spell so if you guys are looking for a red eyeshadow I would totally recommend this it's gorgeous and um, if you guys are looking for swatches of any of these colors that come in the loaded collection rain 528i has a video um, she did amazing swatches so I'll go ahead and leave that link in the side all right so I hope it's wearable I hope you guys like it and I'll talk to you guys soon the next color will be orange obviously <laughs> all right, bye guys